the biggest money I've ever made somebody is about 300 million. I showed him this technique of doing investments and he did it in a super high speed way. And within a period of six to nine years, she started to get greedy and did this sort of big way of investments. I don't think he knew how to handle it properly. He ended up spending that money on things like the Bitcoin farming, put a lot of properties that didn't make sense. Remarried twice, moved down south, started to hang around with the wrong type of people, bought himself a nice big office, new building, and a period of just six years, he lost all that money. He's running right now because all his investments went negative and people he hang around with, I guess he borrowed money from them because now they're looking for him. Mm -hmm. Basically, he's hiding. What's the strategy to make 300 million? You buy a property, you get refinancing, you get some extra money come out of it, but it's a loan. Once upon a time in Malaysia, you could do a lot of it. For example, you just don't do one loan, you do multiple submissions. And the banks can't track it. Last time when the, the system was inferior, the banks will actually only track one property that's been bought. But the actual fact is you may have bought the second and the third and the fourth. So I did share with people that there's this hack in the, the system that the banks cannot see that you have actually bought a property or two or three for a short period of time. And if you actually do it well enough, you can get away buying an extra one or two properties. This guy went all crazy and bought about 10 properties at one time. And he repeated the process with his wife and his friends and many, many others and he multiplied that. And that's a very easy way for him to accumulate a debt of more than 300 million.